السلام علیکم ڈیئر فیلوز دس از سائم علی اینڈ دس از دی موسٹ امپورٹنٹ پارٹ آف دی ریپلیکیشن آئی ہوپ یو ول انڈرسٹینڈ اٹ ریئلی کوکلی اٹ از سمپل جسٹ کیپ یور مینٹل ٹینشن ہیئر لیٹس گیٹ اسٹارٹ سو ایز یو کین سی دا فرسٹ نوٹ ہیونگ دی فولڈر آف ریپلیکیشن اینڈ وی ہیو دا لوکل پبلیکیشنس اینڈ وی ہیو کریٹیڈ اے ڈی ڈی ایس ٹرانزیکشنل ریپلیکیشن رائٹ کلک آن اٹ اینڈ گو ٹو دی پراپرٹیز This is a dialog box. This is the articles which we clear, clearly we can see that there is a table replicated that named as employee. We will allow it to go for the peer to peer subscription. Now make it true. Go to the subscription options. Peer to peer replication and make it true and click OK. It means we have given the permission to get it to peer to peer replicate it with the other instances, which is the most important part. Just wait for a second and it's done. Okay, now refresh this instance and now quickly get back to the replications. Now, right click on it, click on the configure peer to peer topology. There is a wizard open, click next. This is the server main server node and this is the transaction replication click next wait a second and this is the major server instance you can see this is simul epc mysql server and it is the first instance that is allowing the peer to peer topology with the other two instances now we have to import the second node or attach the second post now right click on it and add a new peer node that will be the second one click the second server or the second instance click connect it is the second choose the database connect all the display node and click ok i'll make it next now you can see that it is mysql server 1 it is mysql server 2 now connect the third one also refresh the topology no no need for this okay add a new peer the third server connect it this is the third server and the same database and click okay and as you can see now there is a topology created it is bidirectional as you can see the arrows these arrows shows that this is a bidirectional peer to peer replication this is clear cut this is you can see you can see the arrows these are the bidirectional arrows and i'll let you know what is bidirectional what does it mean okay now as we have created all three instances nodes successfully click next now the option came load reader agent security now what are the reader reader agent security that is actually our SQL server agent service account that we have created earlier click ok same process with the other instance click ok click next now with these three security agent the same agent SQL server agent account ok ok now next next and now it is finished now wait till all the subscriptions and publications have been successfully done as you can see all the subscri subscriptions and publications are successfully done click close window now it's the time to refresh all the instances again and now we have done with the replication let's check whether it is changing it is replicating and whether it is bidirectional or not let's get to the first node database it's dds employees stable employee and select or edit top 200 rows click one i will write my name second my other colleague name and i've entered to record it as you know okay now i will refresh it I will close this window. I will check the second instance, refresh it. Second instance database. 
DDS employee table employee and when I will edit the top 200 rows I will get to know that these two record is, is also added in the next instances now I will check in the third instance I will refresh my third instance I will get to the databases DDS employees tables edit I will close this window and I will edit these two top 100 rows and you can see there is something pro some problem wait a second guys I don't know whether I have passed the wrong path in the third instance but the top two instances are replicating and they're working well when I will fix up the third instance I'll get back to you okay now if I change the second instance like I put three Um, now as you can see I have put in in the second instance I have changed the second instance now I will close the second instance and I will check it whether the first instance having the replication or not databases DDS employee tables and I will check it and as you can see it is changed so that is why it is bi-directional I don't know what happened with the third instance but I'll fix it and I'll get back to you okay thank you so much hope you have learned a lot and goodbye assalamu alaikum